Hi, I'm Bet from Bet's Makes, and today I'm going to discuss a topic that everybody asks me. How do you mirror, or what is mirror, and what is the difference between mirror and flip? So we're going to experiment a little bit, and I'm going to show you the differences and how this works. So the first thing you want to do is open a new project in Cricut Design Space. I'm just going to replace mine right now. Now I'm going to put in some text and that's what we're going to work with right now. I'm just going to type heart and kindness. I'm going to come up here to alignment and I'm going to center it just so it looks better. I'm going to expand it just a little bit and change the color. So let's just click away, click in here, come up to the cut line type and I'll make it uh, purple. Now if I put this on a t-shirt and it was just straight vinyl with a sticky back and I could just push it down, there's no issue. I don't have to worry about anything. If I want to make this on iron-on, you have to realize that there's a shiny side and a rough side to each piece of iron-on. And the shiny side is where you're going to put it down on the mat and then cut the letters. And when you put it down on the mat, you have to cut it backwards because you're going to flip that shiny side over so that you can read the text on the shiny side. Now that's the biggest key right there. If you have a shiny side that goes down on the mat, you will always use flip or mirror for your design. Now. My biggest issue is I get excited, I go to make it, I forget to switch over to mirror. And it does remind me. So another little tool you can use with heart and kindness here, if you come up over here, you will find that there is another thing that you can use and it's called flip. Now I can flip it vertical or horizontal. Now if I flip it horizontal, I don't have to worry about mirror when I get to the other side. Now you can flip it the other way as well. So now if I go to make it, and I'll just click on make it here, you'll see that it's already set up. Now if I put the mirror on, it's going to come back to the regular way. Now I just don't want to do that. I like using the flip because it says for mirror on iron iron, and it will remind you when you get a little further in. So let's just cancel this. So that is my simple little trick. Use flip when you're in the design phase so that you know when you're using iron on with a shiny side that it will automatically put the shiny side down on the mat and then your design will cut from there. So flip for me works a lot better than mirror, but you may decide that you want to use mirror. Now, any material that has a shiny side that goes down on the mat, even a vinyl, and you're cutting from the back side, you will have to make sure you either flip or mirror it. I hope this helps a little bit, and until next time, happy crafting.